Here in Palo Alto, California, we set up a demo for the U.S. Assistant Secretary of Commerce, Alan Davidson, and the mayor of Palo Alto, Lydia Ku, to showcase a wireless broadband solution that gets connectivity where it's needed most, quickly and cost-effectively. This first instance of NGFWA, short for Next Generation Fixed Wireless Access, is a new technology that addresses the drawbacks of traditional fixed wireless access. Already deployed by over 200 ISPs in 45 states in the U.S., NGFWA delivers fiber class speeds, high capacity, cost efficiency, and deployments in months instead of years, even with obstructed links and interference. In this demo, two wireless links, each with a base radio and remote radio, were deployed. The first link was 0.7 miles in distance, near line of sight and running in 5 GHz. To produce interference, eight laptops and two access points were also set up just meters away. In order to illustrate the benefits of two unique NGFWA technologies, interference cancellation and dynamic beam forming, we first measure link performance with these key technologies disabled and turned off. We record a download speed of 20 megabits per second and upload speed of 10 megabits per second. Keeping interference cancellation turned off, we turn on dynamic beamforming, which improves our download speed to 210 megabits per second and uplink speed to 50 megabits per second. Now, when enabling these two NGFWA technologies at the remote radio, the link is further improved. Even with buildings in the way, we were able to achieve 470 megabits per second download and 120 megabits per second upload speeds, enough for the most bandwidth intensive activities, including multiple 4K HD streams. The second link was 5.2 miles in distance, completely non-line of sight and running in 3 GHz CBRS spectrum. With interference cancellation and dynamic beamforming enabled and turned on, we were able to get speeds of 415 megabits per second download and 95 megabits per second upload. Dynamic beamforming allows the use of reflections to smartly combine signals coming from different directions, so turning the remote radio in different positions ensures the link stays connected and stable. Note that the FCC defines reliable, high-capacity home broadband as 100 megabits per second download and 20 megabits per second upload. And here we've shown that NGFWA technology not just meets, but significantly exceeds that standard, rivaling GPON fiber network performance. While fiber is an excellent broadband solution, it's just not economically practical to deploy everywhere, given the cost per mile and long installation timeframes. NGFWA's technology advances are enabling service providers to deliver unprecedented service and close the digital divide. You've really got to see it to believe it. Visit TorontoWireless.com to learn more.